hello guys welcome back to a new video so here we go this um, this is our new project for the TV and film we got a Corgi Gran Torino Starskin Hutch so this is what we're gonna deal with in this video Uh, it just came today it's not too bad screen is there just a couple of scratches a little bit of crack in the back here pillar is broken here but yeah otherwise <clears throat> front suspension the both sides is broken here and here as well but i'm sure it's not a big deal can be done otherwise car is there all the plastic uh, base is here not broken back bumper in one piece front bumper as well so yeah not too bad so let me crack and open guys see what is it, what uh, what we're gonna find inside and then um, we'll take it from there guys I'll see you in a bit okay here we go um, we drill the rivets so <coughs> let's see what we're gonna have here As we expected, yeah, the front suspension is broken here, but it's um, it's easy fix. Plastic, a little bit of glue and baking soda will sort the problem out. There you go. Here we have a, a plastic thing making the noise coming from the back suspension that's one and we're gonna need one more should be here and one more we're gonna put it here and we should be good to go that's the interior no rivets on the screen so it just come out good clean and a little bit polish should be nice so that's gonna go for cleaning this one we're gonna work on it after that we're gonna spray it all in chrome and this one is gonna go for stripper so I'll see you guys later on There you go, so a couple of hours later, a little bit of glue here on the pillar with uh, baking soda, we fix it. What I did, I filed a little bit here because it was the, there was quite deep scratches. So I filed a little bit, this corner here it was same come on focus there you go it was a little bit damaged so i filed it as well on the roof here i'll work a little bit on this one a little bit more because they will come up on the paint so uh yeah i'm gonna go around and see like here for example as well a little bit so I'm still gonna go around with the file a little bit around and uh, fix these uh, things and then uh, it will go for primer and uh, paint um, the base 
we did uh, we did the wheels we did the uh, missing um, suspension plastic in the back the broken one piece I glue it back again glue and baking soda here I made up a piece of plastic as well because this was missing and in the front the front wheels which these two this one and this one they was missing same just glued piece of plastic done and dusted um, I will uh, try to file as well this little bit of uh, scratches deep was one come on focus there you go go with this and then you will go for uh, paint we're gonna paint it in chrome so that's done uh, this uh, the wheel wheel cups same I'm just gonna wash them and uh, paint them in chrome and pretty much that's it for now um, I'll come back later once we um, once we paint, uh, paint it and then um, I'll show you what I have see you in a bit guys there you go guys so here we go we have the car painted I'm just gonna give it till tomorrow to get proper dry and then tomorrow I'm gonna do the the white stripe on it base is done paint it fix it paint it hopefully by tomorrow it's gonna dry a bit better the center cup on the wheels as well they are done base is done as well so um, yeah I'll see you tomorrow guy with the final product after we do the white stripe on it we're just gonna put it back together and uh, yeah that's it I'll see you later guys hello hello there you go guys we got the car painted uh, I think is uh, well hopefully it is uh, proper dry so I gave him like uh, more than 24 hours so it should be all right this one unfortunately they need like uh, six months I don't know why what's wrong with this paint so still it's, it's better than yesterday but still I don't want to touch it like uh, you know but yeah done dusted fix it suspension fixed everything so I spray chromed everywhere everything yeah it looks like if you do just like that it's fine but if you look if i keep like longer still leave prints so yeah <clears throat> base is done as well i do it just like i spray a little bit it's, it's plastic anyway so i pray i spray it just with the matte black a little bit to cover a little bit that scratches and uh, stuff so um yeah today what we're gonna do today we're gonna do the crop part we're gonna do the white stripe over here so we have paint uh, tape here uh, ready I will uh, I will tape it and um, 
then uh, I'll come back to you guys to show you what I did and how I did it but at the moment I will start to tape to put a tape all around this line we're gonna come up to here normally I see in the pictures there like well the original one the movie one the white stripe it comes up to here where the um, this uh, light on the wing is you know but on this casting I see is that the, actually the line finish somewhere here around so um, I'm not sure if you can see yeah so you see the the line normally in the in the pictures and whatever I saw on Google the lights come somewhere around here the light the the line sorry the white line just somewhere here around the the wing light but here on the casting this one finish just here see so I think it will look a little bit uh, crappy if I'm going with the line a bit more here and this one finish here so I will just go with the casting you know so I'll do it that way you know so yeah guys uh, I'll come back to you after I um, I do the the taping see you in a bit alrighty then so here we go we taped all the car uh, I'm gonna go quick and uh, spray it because this tape I'm not very happy with it it leaves some uh, marks on the paint anyway I'm um, I'll give a luck after that on all the cars so um, yeah let's see what's gonna come up so see you in a bit guys there you go it is white now we'll see I'm gonna leave it to dry for a little bit I don't want to take the tape off because probably will um, leave some marks I will leave it to dry for a bit and then um, I'll come back to you guys and see what we come up with see you in a bit alrighty then you guys so here we go back again all done just locker it unfortunately I did have a couple of you know when the tape he was I don't know if you're gonna focus yeah there you go uh, when I cut the tape around this when I locker it you start to the the stripe it was shrinking a little bit so unfortunately yeah I have to touch it up a little bit it's not uh, obviously on the camera probably you're gonna get everything but like with this like uh, with naked eye it's not too bad to be honest with you and um, I managed to do the stripe up to the end here exactly how I um, how I saw it on the Google picture the original one both of the sides so I'm quite happy with that yeah otherwise everything nice and shiny is um, well probably later on we're gonna get better but to be honest with you, this time I'm quite happy with what I did. I would expect a little bit, a little bit better, but uh, that's fine. That's okay. He's alright. If it was not this uh, shrinking stuff, it would be perfect. <coughs> but <coughs> yeah, it is what it is. So I'm just gonna leave the lacquer to, to dry and then I'm gonna put everything back together then we'll do the details there you know I will um, 
I'm planning to do all this um, chrome around so um, I don't know a little bit of uh, headache and crazy job but uh, yeah hopefully I'm not gonna I'm not gonna mess it around or I might just leave it like that <laughs> because it doesn't look very very good for now but yeah till it gets dry I'm gonna think about it and we'll see uh, I'm gonna watch more more uh, pictures and uh, yeah we'll try to get it as much as possible to the um, to the original one so yeah guys it is what it is this is what we came out with so um, I'll see you later on alrighty then so here we go with our final product because I still don't want to touch it yet because it's still this chrome it takes so long to dry so there you go I try to to focus a lot on the detail so I got the um, I got the picture down from the internet and have a look at it and this is kind of look the front with the black stripe rubber band on the on the front bumper you know the red here between the the grill so yeah did the chrome around the window side ones as well the back one as well and we did the back the same thing chromed around the lights and a little rubber stripe on the bumper so yeah this is our um, movie TV movie film project done Starskin Hatch Ford Grand Torino Corgi so this is what we get guys just this uh, little things here on top unfortunately it didn't came up as I want it I would uh, I would want it to change the wheels as well but unfortunately I didn't find nothing like uh, to, to to be like with the original but yeah it's different than it was looks a lot better is uh, everything in one piece hope you like it guys hope you enjoy it as I enjoy it I enjoy so much doing this uh, this challenge so thank you very much for watching guys if you didn't subscribe yet please feel free to subscribe we're gonna have uh, other ones coming very soon I'm not sure what what I'm gonna start now after this one but yeah I'm gonna see you in the next video and you're gonna find out guys yeah thank you very much again guys take care and uh, see you in the next video